Why did you decide to invest in the Ultracam Dragon 4.2? Yeah, well, we, we looked at the 4.1 uh, when it came out two years ago, and we decided that the footprint was uh, a bit too small for us, so too many flight lines to capture an area. Uh, then um, we started to using the Osprey in combination with uh, Regal 680, so we could capture the three products for which we see demand. We, we actually have customers who prefer to capture the three products in one go uh, because it's more economic. And uh, now, of course, that the sensor is a uh, 250 megapixel, it reduces the flight lines and it it made it totally sensible for us to uh, to invest in the camera. Uh, moreover, apart from the resolution, uh, we have seen with our combination of um, Osprey and Regal, which is great, that we do need a camera, or sorry, a plane with two hatches. And uh, we do have two planes with two hatches, uh, but they are piston planes, so we are bound to Europe and uh, we fly across the world and in many places we will need a turbine plane. So this camera will allow us to fly it anywhere. Uh, also in countries where uh, where we don't have avgas fuel. The other way around as well, we have low-level work in Europe where we have to fly slow and we bumped also there into the restriction when we were using this combination with the dual-hatch aircraft because it's a, a fast-flying aircraft, you cannot fly so slow. So with this camera we get more uh, use case on the slow end and also on the flying in foreign countries. Um, we love to subcontract for, uh, for customers across the globe and I think this is a great asset for us in addition to, uh, to the fleet that we have. As Lackbaum is one of the leading aerial survey companies on the market, to what extent did the UltraCam uh, portfolio contribute to that success? Well, in a great way, we've stepped into it with the UltraCam D. Funny enough, this is also called UltraCam D, but uh, the first one was in 2005. And uh, I think we grew together with Fexel, uh, always having uh, the front edge and uh, definitely we have gained a lot of ground being able to work effectively. The cameras are effective and the workflow, we love the workflow and uh, so yeah, we, we have now an inventory of uh, six cameras in various types so we can deploy the type of camera that works best for the job. Certainly this is a very capable camera but on some jobs it will be not the best one to use so we can also uh, use uh, an Eagle or, uh, uh, or an Osprey so we can send the camera that uh, does, does best on the job. You just said that you have an impressive lineup of, of Ultracam systems already available, the Ultracam Eagle 4.1, the Osprey 4.1, now the Dragon 4.2, with the Merlin uh, already also uh, announced at Intergeo. Is there room for another bird of prey in your Ultracam collection? Another bird of prey, I love, <laughs> I love it, but I think for now we are, we, we are okay with the lineup and uh, we first have to, uh, to see that we get this uh, Dragon out of its cage. So, uh, yeah, for the moment, let's fly a bit. Perfect. Thank you very much. Thank you.